Alright, what is up guys, Putty here, and welcome back for another Fallout 3 video. I'm going to turn my volume down, because in the last part we were listening to Agatha's songs. And we still are, basically. Um, I'm going to go off now, and I'm going to travel on the home front with you guys, which is this one. Hopefully it doesn't glitch out like it did on my other playthrough. Ah, uh, yeah. Ooh! We are already a quarter way to f level 18. I guess that's what playing on hard difficulty does for you. I usually play on normal. I know on uh, on Fallout 3 you have more experience the higher difficulty you play on. In uh, New Vegas that is different. And uh, my uh, <laughs> my HUD is still off from the last part too. Goody. Alright, so uh, we're gonna just continue on with the uh, vault. To the vault 101. <laughs> The only vault we haven't gone to, well, after we finish this next main quest, the only vault we wouldn't have gone to is, uh, Vault 106. Come on, don't glitch out on me. Aha! This is an automated distress message from Vault Tech. Vault 101. Message begins. It feels like you left home a long time ago, but I know you're still out there. I just hope you're still alive to hear this. Things got worse after you left. My father's gone mad with power. If you can hear this, please stop looking for your dad and help stop mine. I changed the door password to my name. If you're hearing this, and if you still care enough to help me, you should remember it. Message repeats. This is... Yep, that's the quest. I don't know if it actually that adds a quest to our. Yes, it does. Come on, the whole point. There you go. I actually plan on using this quest to get a new companion. So, um, Sergeant RL3, you've been fantastic. Like I love RL3. He's a tank. He's amazing. Great storage companion, and he's probably going to be my final companion. Um, if if I do Broken Steel, he'll be my companion there. Um, but for now, I want to spice things up a bit. And this new companion will probably die soon, like Clover did anyway. Actually, Clover? Yeah, Clover is dead on this save file. Because, um... On this save file, I actually killed Clover myself. Rescuing kids. Stop right there. Wait a... Yeah, whatever. Where the hell is the mother? Whoa, what? I mean... Wh whatever. You know what? Just take me... To matter. I know things have gotten crazy. So what now? Yeah, can you leave me somewhere? Yeah. Sorry, I, I didn't want to talk to this guy for ages. Like, I'm, I'm not in the mood. I will talk to him after and maybe the overseer for a bit. But obviously, I'm gonna. There, there's the, the overseer has closed off the vault for good. Uh, Amata and Butch oh. and stuff, uh, rebels, to and what they are doing. like trying to fight back. And the overseer has gone mad with power and is trying to like kill them and shit. And, oh, it's such a mess. But honestly, it doesn't, it doesn't matter. It does not matter at all. Yes, I am quite tired, by the way. I have, uh... That's it, old I have been... We're opening up that for door. And to hell with the overseer's rules. You know I can't Stay do that, this. Freddy. Now get back down below. Before I have to do something we'll both regret. What? You're gonna lock me up like you did to Brotch? You can't cage a tunnel snake, man. Because we rule! Stay back! What the hell? Stop shooting! Don't you know enough to? You almost shot Freddy. I didn't mean to fire. I really didn't. I just wanted to scare him off. But he had a knife. I can't be too careful with those rebels. You almost shot Freddy. Damn it! <laughs> I guess you can see how bad. Can okay, you just go me to a map? That's whatever. Just take me to a. I want to go. I don't know why I'm a bit OCD today, I just want to finish this quest. I'm kind of bored. I don't actually like this quest that much, actually. I think I used to. I like Eye of the Song because the music's kind of good. Actually, I think the music's copyright free. I'm gonna check that on for you guys so you don't get bored from my, uh. But this is just a quick thank you to my new friend. Thank you for bringing me what I've been searching for all these years. 
Oh, feels kind of good. It's copyright free, I'm pretty sure. So, if it's not, I like, get copyright strikes on this video just because of Agatha's station. Kind of sad. Damn you, Agatha. I think I can handle things from you, uh, Officer Gomez. I believe it is up one of these stairs and two in the corner. Yep, it's these ones. What's up, Butch? Damn. It. Help, what kind of help? What sort of help do you think I mean? You must have heard about the changes since you left, right? The deaths, the lies, the whole overseer lockdown thing? Ringing any bells? Man, they'd have rushed in here long ago if they didn't know I stole one of their guns from when they issued martial law. Anyway, you gotta help us get out of here. You gotta help me get out of here. Sure, yeah, I'm trying to help the entire vault. Man. Alright, Rich. What do you think? What are you doing, Rob? The damn goat said I'm supposed to. I'm a barber. You got that? There's a difference. I see. Can you give me a haircut? Sure, fine. Whatever. I think it is time for a bit of a change. I'm gonna ride and stop. There's <laughs> not much of a difference considering I have a hood on my head, but it works. <laughs> God, you're back! You got my. I missed your sense of humor, but I. Okay. If you saved my life back then, I'm at least I can do this right now. Wish we could have saved more people. Damn. How did they find that out? What if I just. <laughs> you're absolutely. Okay. Okay, I, I think I'll have a solution. Um. Yeah. Don't worry. Yeah, violence is not my style, really. You know, I I don't like I, I I like killing people in the name of justice, but I don't really kill a lot of people. I'm just like um, actually I don't like killing people. I like killing animals in in the game. In the game, I need to make a clear establishment here. In the game, I'm trying I'm trying to deduce the character of uh, Francisca Van Houston. Alright, uh, yes, that needs to be clear. Well, oh! I... Hey there, bro! Yeah, okay. You're the crazy bastard who mur murdered Jonas. I assume you're talking about the unpleasantness when you left? Yes? Jonas and your father were endangering the future success of this vault and the safety of its residents. I did what I had to do to keep them from destroying all we had achieved here. I only wish I could have prevented it from happening at all. Yeah. Don't try and justify your murders and lies, they were never threats. Threat. <laughs> Spoken like someone who's never had to make difficult decisions. Like someone who's never had to lead. Jonas was leaving with your father. Their departure would lead to others leaving as well. And before you know it, half of the vault would be gone. And then, our home, the last safe, pure bastion of humanity, would be reduced to a lonely handful of aging holdouts, too few to continue. You know, the vault doesn't have to be isolated in order to keep its residents safe. And what makes you so certain about that? I can't imagine you're still so naive after spending time in that hell outside. None of them know what the outside is like, and most of them would die out there. Then the rest of us inside would eventually die out too. I won't risk all of our lives just for a few people's. I believe I have a solution to the vault's problems. To fix what you started? Go ahead and humor me. The rebels are right. You need to open the vault. Oh, do you? What makes you think you. Ha <laughs> ha! 100%, baby. You simply don't have enough people to stay isolated down here forever. I admit, in the 200 years since the war, our numbers have dwindled a little, but we have enough genetic diversity for a few more generations. My god, you're right. 
We won't last another hundred years, whether or not we get supplies from the outside. We're the last bastion of pure humanity, and we're doomed. Humanity isn't about pure genetics, it's about never giving up hope. Even. That's bullshit! The only mission you Vault ever had was keeping his residents alive. <laughs> and you expect me to believe that the only way to do that is to let them travel out in the wastes and mingle with those savages? I suppose it would allow them to stay alive, and we could still keep... And I know only one person with the proper attitude to do that. I'll inform my daughter Amata that she is the new overseer. Effective immediately. Yay, I've gained karma. Oh god, please no. RL3, I'm sorry. Don't kill me. I want to be neutral. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. I need to be neutral for this next companion. Damn. I'm getting a new companion when I get out of the vault anyway. What's the point of this one? I'll get a new companion. I'll get this that companion I was planning when I get evil again. Which will probably be after the game's finished. Um, I might do broken. Like, I, I wanna, wanna put this out on the table. I'm not sure if I'm doing broken steel yet. It definitely won't be now. Everyone, if I am doing broken cool steel, it will have to be after in a, a few months. Friend. Maybe after I've done New Vegas. I've made an important decision. In my attempts to keep us all safe, I have been, perhaps, overzealous. Lives have been lost, but perhaps worse than that, lives have been stopped. And in my attempts to keep you safe, I have kept you from growing up. I know I have made these mistakes, and I would make them again if I had to do so. That is why I cannot remain. Father! Amata, I appoint you overseer in my place. You've proven you have what it takes to make hard choices for the good of the vaults. I'm just sorry I didn't understand that earlier. Consider it one of many mistakes I've made. I Thank never you, Father. You'd I'll be do back. my best to keep us all safe inside the vault and beyond. You're welcome, my dear. And now. If you'll excuse me, I feel quite worn down. We'll deal with the details soon, in private. Until then, I'm sure there are people waiting to congratulate you. You did it! Why won't you just leave us alone? We've done enough damage! <laughs> I fixed it. I, I just heard. My father says he's stepping down as overseer. He won't tell me why, but I have to assume it's something you said to him. <coughs> I had a little, uh, yeah, all quite civil. You and him? Civil? Yeah. But I guess we'll all be learning a bit about... Th it's a bright new day for the vault, but I'm afraid there's one thing that has to change. Yeah, whatever it is, I'm glad to help. I know you are. And on behalf of the vault, I thank you for all you've done. But there are still many who blame you for everything that happened. So, I have to ask you to leave. I'm sorry, but the situation is just too delicate for you to stay. Please, if you really want to help the vault, you have to go. I understand. Goodbye, Amara. We can never really thank you enough for ever. It'll be a while before we're actually ready to- Alright, that's fine. So okay, I'm gone now. <laughs> Modified utility this... jumpsuit. What Deal is this? Again. Looks okay, I guess? Luck plus one radiation Oh, that's not bad. Super fill in then's power armor. Well, oh, that's not very nice. Let's just make sure the, the medicine bobblehead is near. You killed her. You killed Beatrice, Andy. There's no excuse for that. RL3 is a much better Mr. Andy than you. You could have probably uh, saved Beatrice. Damn you, Andy. How dare you? How dare you, Andy? How dare you? How oh, very dare you? How dare you? Well, in this part, we uh, we finished trouble on the home front, and um, 
This might be one video, actually. Yeah, it's probably just going to be a 15-minute video. In the next part, uh, we're going to head to the Citadel. We're going to finish the game. We're going to finish. The, we're going to start the uh, first, final few parts of the game. Probably going to be about five more parts left. This has been part 39, 40, and 41, I believe. I'll get three episodes out of this. Thanks for watching. And uh, you too. You almost shot Freddy. Damn you! Worse than goddamn Andy. You son of a bitch. <sighs> anyway, to finish it. Actually, with in four videos, we've gotten three achievements. That's progress. <laughs> That's progress. One sec. No, currently we've gotten two achievements in four videos. That's about to change slightly. Well, they'll kill them all. Have we got enemies on on the home front here? <laughs> I think I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? Yes, I am. <laughs> yes. Two achievements. What the hell? What's this? The Radroach? Yeah. Oh, oh. Thank you. Alright, we've gotten two achievements in four videos. And. Boom. Close this one. And. Travel on the home front. Three achievements, four videos. This is a very good uh, side quest, Little Frenzy. Currently, I have. 585 games go on this account. 570 comes from this game. Anyway, in the next part, we're gonna start the end game quests. And, um, yeah. So, let's just check, see what quests we have that we're not gonna do. We're not gonna do that one, but we are, of course, doing that one. So, what? Does it not give me a quest marker? I guess I'll just go to the city. Anyway, yeah, yeah, in the next part or whenever I do get back to doing this let's play because it took me a lot to actually muster up the goddamn energy to do this recording session. Let's hope it doesn't fail. Alright, I hope you enjoyed the video and from this epic power armor wearing girl who probably has big titties but we can't see her. <laughs> Joke. Anyway, from, from me, from me, finally, let's stop my blabbering, from me. Peace out.